Update 7.5 brought with it the Breaker Blast base and a rather recognisable enemy to the game. But before that, a cheeky sponsorship. This video has been very kindly sponsored by Iniba in partnership with Trustly, which is a payment method provider. And in addition to their sale going on till the 9th of May, they're offering a stonks 3% influencer discount just for viewers of yours truly. If you use the Trustly payment method on Aniba, the link to that is in the description. Now, I'd like to thank Trustly for their commitment to transparency. I always try to make sure that I'm being as honest and plain as possible with you about what these companies are asking me to say instead of making claims. Trustly is a payment provider that makes it easy to pay with your bank account, make your purchase super easy and pay from your bank with Trustly. No app, no registration, no manual entries and very secure. It's easier to pay with Trustly than other alternatives as you don't need to have any cards or passwords while also paying with the money you already have. Now, I've checked this myself and it does certainly seem that you can trust. Trustly, they are on what's known as the Open Banking Register, and that is a regulated financial website that indicates what institutions are approved to connect to your bank account and use your money to make payments with. So go and make the most of both of those discounts, and my thanks to Aniba in partnership with Trustly for sponsoring this video. Update 7.5's chief addition was the Breaker Blast base. Finally, a cannon that you could take against those pesky red barriers of the starred aliens in Cats of the Cosmos. Fire this and any barrier would be destroyed, enabling you to bring a slot that has nothing with a barrier breaking ability, but still be able to get through levels with a modest amount of barriers. A key example perhaps being something like Ultra Barbar with an impenetrable barrier normally, but if there's not too many of them, a very penetrable barrier indeed. I need to think about the way I say things. As you might expect in an update generally, there were Uncanny Legend stages added. The subchapter being Law of the Wildlands, still in the wild lands of further than I've managed to get myself. Additionally, Mousyland gained its fourth star, pretty terrifying quite frankly, and true to form user rank rewards were added from 9,100 to 9,500. There were also three cat combos added, Kimono Champs featuring Vengeful Cat, which looking through the cat combo menu, features in a large number of combos. And then Post-Apocalypse featuring Snarukani, Biker and Cat Gang, and then Growth Spurt, which features Verbena and Sumo. I don't usually talk about stages added, but Update 7.5 did bring a stage of particular note, and that is Deeply Dreaming. The big blowy sneezy boy Baku was introduced in this update. And the update also saw an addition to the progression of Wraths of Cyclones, this time Peerless 2 was added to the lineup of stronger cyclones. And that is just about update 7.5. Nothing groundbreaking, but certainly stands the test of time. Nothing in there has particularly gone by the wayside, especially thinking of our ability to more effectively deal with barrier starred aliens and also the big blowy boy who keeps turning up in regular guises even to this day. I hope you enjoyed.